Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another apartment Instagram video. I need a catchier name. Someone help me out with this. What do I call these? But basically, I am going to be scrolling around on my Instagram and looking at different apartments and whatnot, and I am going to tell you what I think about them, what I like about them, what I don't like about them, what I would change, what I think is super cool. It's a fun time. We gotta look at some cool apartments, and this is just a lot of fun. Today, I am using the hashtag apartment goals. Let's see what comes up. I love seeing things like this because I think it's super funny what some people consider like goals like and then compared to other people like one man's trash is another man's treasure and you can see it in what their apartment goals are. All right that being said let's go ahead and jump into this. If this is your first of these like Instagrammy videos that you've seen of mine basically what I'm doing is screen recording on my Instagram and I'm just gonna scroll through and show you what pops up as I'm looking at it so that we were able to look at the same thing and talk about it and see what we all think and by we all I mean me because unfortunately I can't hear you, but feel free to tell me what you think in the comments because I love to know. All right, let's go ahead and start. Okay, I want to start with this reel because like that's fun. There's a reel. Let's listen. Okay, the fact that this two bedroom apartment is going for 1,183 in San Antonio, Texas. Like, do I move to San Antonio, Texas for this? Just kidding. I have absolutely no need for a two bedroom apartment. But wow, that is so nice. This apartment in Chicago would be like 4,000. It'd be a lot more than it is on here. Moving into actual static photos. This is fun. This is super not my style. It's a little too colorful for me, but so fun. Also, I can't stand carpet, but love a blue wall, love a gallery wall, love like when it's like actual art that like people have picked out that they really like themselves. Like, I think that's super cool. Like making it more curated versus just like stock pictures and art that you would get at like TJ Maxx and Ikea, but super cool. Love the lampshade. We love a pop of yellow. I don't know. I think that's a cool space. Oh, London. That's fun. Oh my gosh. Wait, this person has my same rug. That's cool. <laughs> Can you see it? No. I have the same exact rug in my living room. I like this one. I, it's definitely like more of a vintage apartment, but I think it's very pretty. And like those windows are really, really big considering it's a vintage apartment. I feel like most older apartments have very small windows and that's my biggest gripe because I need light, thrive with light. Um, but this is super cute. They've got their little plants, their couch pulls out into a bed. That's from Ikea. I recognize that bad boy. Um, and I'm a sucker for it because we have the same rug. Okay, this is like so pretty. Like this is like an Instagram queen's apartment here. I will never Never be able to be that aesthetic with my apartment. I'm too quirky. Like all of my stuff is like too like colorful, mixed. I don't know. I have too much woods and leathers and other like prints and things that I love to throw around. But I think this is such a pretty style. I love the pompas. Pompas? Pompas. Wow. And that view. I wonder where this is. Where are you? Let's deep dive. Where do we think this is? This is, it doesn't say. Where do you live? Manhattan, that makes sense. Yep, New York, New York. That is a pretty apartment and she's got a very cute family. River Oaks, now I'm just so intrigued at like where these places are. A subsidy of what? Louisiana, wow, that is a huge kitchen. What could you ever put in that many cabinets? Like I have a lot of kitchen stuff and that's just a lot of cabinets in a massive deck. This is cool. Wow, that's so pretty. I want a giant standalone bathtub. Wow, what's behind the second door? This is beautiful. Front load in washers and dryers and giant closets. That place is luxury, Houston. Oh, it says Houston, but I definitely, it showed the location as Louisiana. Now I don't know, now I don't know, but that was cool. Okay, I love this. Like if I was a single female, I think this is what my apartment would look like. And it basically is kind of what my apartment looks like, but I've toned it down just a little bit. So that way it's also Alex's apartment and not just mine. But look at that peacock colored couch. Is it from West Elm? Oh no, it's from Wayfair. I don't know. Now I'm confused. There's a lot of brands. Anyways, that's so cute. I love the color. Like it's like pops of color, but doesn't feel like overwhelming. I just think she's cute. And the Monstera in the corner. We love her. We love her. I love this one. Brooklyn, New York. Good one. That's a nice apartment. Oh, okay. We love her too. That is such a cool mirror. Give me details. Tell me more things. Where is it from? Urban Outfitters. Of course. So trendy. So expensive. That is a very cool apartment. Very like boho desert-esque, but she designed it super well. Oh, what are these things called? What are these things called? Someone tell me, what do we call them? I like them. I like this. I would live in this. Two for two on some really cool apartments. New Jersey, New Jersey and Brooklyn. They just got it covered. Wow, is this real? This is real. Wow. 
That's, oh my God, oh my God, this is stunning. Like, okay, even take away the fact that you have the most ridiculous view in the entire world. These windows alone, I need this. That is the coolest apartment I've ever seen. I don't even care what the rest of the apartment is. It could just be this little staircase in this living room area and I would rent it. That is absolutely freaking stunning. I'm obsessed. It's like skylights, but better. Wow. Very cool. Ooh, oh, well, this is a fun one too. Wow, look at all our plants. Brooklyn, New York, plants with a view. Yeah, yeah, those plants have a view, all right. Oh, okay, so a little apartment refresh. Yeah, looks much cuter with the white fuzzy couch. Is it fuzzy? It is fuzzy. Yeah, much better. Also, did she get more plants? I don't know, something, but I like it. This is so cozy. I love this. I want to hang out in here when there's a storm outside. I really only like hanging out indoors when it's stormy outside. Like, I think that's how I imagine myself in all cozy places. Even in my current apartment, I'm like, ooh, I can't wait till it snows and it's like stormy outside and I'm in here. I don't know. I just feel like that's the epitome of cozy. But this, you could not get cozier. I love that. I love that striped bedding too. I really want something like that. Oh my gosh. And there's a hidden cat. He's so small. Is he watching Netflix? What is he doing? I don't know. I love him. Whoa. What? That's interesting. Kind of a vibe. St. Petersburg, Russia. I also kind of hate it. It's really cool, but I feel like it looks like they put a bed in a giant bathtub. It's cool. Definitely would not want it for me. I'm so confused by it. Ooh, very cool hotel room though. Is it a hotel room? I don't even know. If this is an apartment, then that bed is like far too massive for the bed or for the apartment. I have questions. Oh boy. Okay. Are we going to deep dive into this one? Cause it looks so stinking cute. This Instagram is called the retro flat. I must learn more. She has a peacock chair and look at this rug. Stop. Wait, it actually is so cute. It reminds me of my grandma. If my grandma was like super cool. How cute is she? Wait, I love this. You go girl with your Instagram. This apartment's so cute. I am such a fan. Her Beatles pillow, so cool. Oh, this is fun. This is cute, I wonder where it is. Oh God, I'm clicking everything. Bromley, UK, how cool. We love to see it, so cute. Wow, that's a fun apartment. I like you, the retro flat. Okay, it may not be my favorite wall, but it's got a dog and I love the dog. That's pretty cool. I don't know, moving on. Okay, this is cute. I like this one, San Diego, California. This kitchen is very cute. I like that it's just like very white and bright and like the plants, like that's really my aesthetic. I like light, I like bright, I like plants. It's simple. They've got the, what is it? The every pan, only pan, the only pan. I think that's right. Anyways, this place is super cute. I like it. I would like to cook in that kitchen. I'm a sucker for a kitchen island, but I still like it. Wow, Florida. Hitting us with those ocean views. Is it an ocean? That's the tricky thing about Florida. I never know if it's like an ocean or like a swamp. It could be either. I can't see, it looks like it's surrounded, but I don't know, but that's a pretty view. Dang, this person's apartment's really cool. This is that same one we saw earlier before she switched out her couch. And that view is just ridiculous. I can't even begin to fathom how much it would cost though to have a corner apartment in Brooklyn, New York. Like that must be so expensive. Oh, she's cute. I like this. I love skylights. I feel like it makes everything like cozier. Gosh, is that? I don't know if that's even true. Why do I like skylights so much? I feel like it just brings like in a homey vibe, you know, picking up what I'm putting down. But the green paint, that rug is like way too Ikea for me. I don't love the rug, but I do like the table and the chairs. I think it's super cute. Ooh, okay. I want to show this one as my last one because this is cool. Penthouse. Oh, I'm so bougie. I was just like, this is a pretty apartment and I want to show it. Penthouse, this Manhattan home is the definite of apartment goals. You know what? Unfortunately, you are correct. This is very cool. I love open staircases like this. I think they're really, really neat. And I think it's like a really nice way to have a staircase without blocking just a ridiculous amount of light. And I can see there's those floor to ceiling windows over there. I don't know what this light fixture is, but I can tell I don't like it along with that couch. But hey, those are things that we can swap. I bet you this apartment has a beautiful view. It's a pet now. It's got to, it's got to. Oh, I don't want to stop. Okay, maybe one more. <laughs> Okay, this is my last one. Florida, why are you so weird? Um, what are these weird couches? They make me feel uncomfortable. I don't like that at all. I don't, I don't want to nap there. I feel like it'd be sticky and I don't love that. But even more, what, what is this? That's a very bold move of a piece of art. I don't really know what's going on here. Is it for sale? If it is, you should probably take that down. I don't know. Anyways, that was fun. Was that fun? I feel like that was kind of fun. That was some, some apartment goals to look at. You never know what's gonna pop up on that feed. I think I'm gonna do this again in do like studios maybe. I feel like apartment goals is quite a wide range of things. 
but I don't know. I love these videos. I think it's fun to just look through and get some inspiration and see what other people are doing and see like how you can translate that into your own apartment. And like, I love that I saw my rug in there. If you guys have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Let me know your guys' thought, which apartment was your favorite out of what you've seen today. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Of course, if you haven't already, hit that big red subscribe button. I post three videos a week and go over to my Instagram. I post a ton more content over there and I would love for you to follow along. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.